prepare the system for the upgrade. Turn off the system. Unplug everything as transducers, USB devices, ACG cables, and the mini dock. Just leave the power supply cable. It's very important to have the system plugged to the AC power all the time during the upgrade. Verify the current version pressing the system key. Then click on system information. Then you will see the boot version and the ARM version. This will be the current software version. And the current patient pressing the patient key. And the new AND key. Check the system time and date by pressing the system key and clicking on time and date. Clear the memory. Erase every patient and image storage on the system. It's convenient to do a backup before this step. You can see my other video to see how to do it. To clear the memory, press the review key and select everything. Then press delete button. And yes. Reboot the system. Be sure that the system has already booted up completely. This memory icon should stop blinking. And percent of free memory is shown under it. You must to have the Sonoside upgrade key. Please leave a comment below if you want to know how to get it. Plug the upgrade key in the front USB port. It's very important to not unplug the USB key during this process. This will cause irreparable damage of your system. Click on Upgrade to begin the upgrade. This will take several minutes. Please be patient and do not stop the process. I'm going to speed up the video to make it shorter. Click on Reboot. The system will reboot and it will take longer than normal. Please wait. Any interruption of this process will damage your system. A new loading bar will be shown. Please wait until it finishes. I'm going to speed up the video to make it shorter. Click on Reboot.